get in shape for the summer. <laughs> Active runner and wanted to support the cause. Reynolds, she was a wonderful lady. This is a great cause. Good chance to get everybody back together. It's sort of a reunion for the, us Georgia Tech kids. Uh, Janine and I met here at Georgia Tech uh, back in the early 90s and uh, started dating back then and uh, got married five years later and we're married for 10 years. Janine was very special in that she was an All-American here at Georgia Tech, number one in the nation at one point in the 400 meters, and uh, went on to do, be a coach at Georgia Tech, and then worked for about nine to 10 years in the knee track organization here at Georgia Tech. Janine and I actually ran track together. She started a year after I did. Janine was one of my track coaches, and she was also one of my sorority sisters. And she was one of my teammates. Janine was uh, one of my teammates in college, so just coming out to show my support. Janine and I went to college together, um, and then we're also sorority sisters, and we're line sisters. So Janine and I go back in, uh, freshman year. We had every class together. We, um, you know, kind of grew up together through Georgia Tech track and field. Oh, she was my go-to girl. Um, she led the fellas and hers, if you will, with a capital H. And um, she was just kind of my go-to girl. She's my spiritual advisor, if you will, and, and relationship advisor as well. So I love her and I miss her dearly. Janine is my niece and I love her dearly. Weizu is actually my brother's son, my nephew, and Sydney is my nephew, and they're a wonderful family. And she touched the lives of so many people that I could tell. And whatever I could do to help, I will, because she was wonderful. My fondest memory is just pledging together, being online. So, and actually, oh, uh, ironically, having to run the campus of Georgia Tech while we were pledging. ACC championship, and um, it was in 1993, 94, and it was when it was Marion Jones's first year, and she beat her in the 200. That's my best memory. Um, I remember her winning the um, MVP. Um, her, I think it was our, our senior year, so that was pretty, pretty nice um, to see all the work that she put in, and uh, at, the, at the conference meet she won the MVP, I believe. So um, well deserved, a lot of hard work, and uh, that's probably my biggest memory. The greatest memory I have, Janine, is Janine is very smart, she's very bright, she uh, always very giving. Um, she never met a stranger. She was just a great person. I mean, that's that's the most you can remember about Janine. She's actually my son's godmother. She's Jasmine's godmom. She's the godmother of my kids. She was a great friend, a great listener, and her warm smile. Just her personality, her smile, and just being Janine. I used to stay up late sitting in the hallway studying because my uh, my roommate always went to sleep very early, so I was out studying in the hall. And Janine would come home from the library studying just as late as I was. So that's probably my biggest memory of Janine. So we miss you. I think uh, the ones that I have always involve the family at Christmas time. She comes over. We used to come together at Christmas time, and I remember her coming over and sharing, uh, playing cards with us and having a good time playing cards. So I enjoyed doing that. How very uh, unique and how detailed uh, that she was about anything uh, that she did. And I think one of my favorite stories was about her husband when he said that uh, at her uh, funeral, he said,
said that she could never see something he was trying to show her on television because she was determined to finish what she had started before leaving it. And I think that was a quite a, a testament to her well-lived life. Beautiful person. Janine was one of the first of our teammates to start a Bible study. So uh, she um, included a lot of the former teammates. So we started uh, having a fellowship uh, like once every couple weeks. So that was that was one of the memorable experiences I remember because she was a uh, real, real good minister, and uh, she started started me on my path in my way. She would come to our dorm room and do Bible study. So that was always so nice. She was a wonderful person. This is a great event, and in her name and in her honor, and just so happy to be here. A little sore today. But we made it through. Uh, I think I beat my time from last year, so next year I'm going to have to take it even further. This is my first time. I love it. I love it. I'm a competitor. I just kind of got out there and just ran. Ran for the glory of, of Janine and the glory of God. She touched the lives of a great many people. So this was just a small thing we could do in her honor. But I think next year um, and the years after, it will continue to be, the, uh, be bigger and better. And we'll make it a very special event.